The modem, a slender box often adorned with a row of LED icons, is your home's gateway to the rest of the digital world. The term, a relic from the dial-up days, is an abbreviation for modulator-demodulator. Modems used to modulate telephone signals into frequencies capable of transmitting digital information. In the present day, most modems employ broadband connections such as cable or satellite to transfer data. There are various types of modems designed to accommodate different connections. If your internet service provider uses cable or fiber internet, a cable plugs into the back of your modem. For those still on a digital subscriber line or DSL, a phone line would be necessary. But what about a router? You may be able to connect to the internet with just a modem, provided you're fine with plugging your device directly into the ethernet port. However, for simultaneous internet access on multiple devices, be it laptops, desktops, or smartphones, a router becomes imperative. Routers, typically flat devices with antennas protruding, hook up to your modem via an ethernet cable, acting as a conduit between the direct internet and your home network. After you connect your devices, the router routes your modem's network traffic to them, either through ethernet wires or wirelessly via Wi-Fi. It also works in reverse, routing data from your computer back to the web. Recognizing the difference between these two devices is more than just tech trivia. Particularly if you're interested in optimizing your internet connection, it's essential to know that the router directs Wi-Fi signals. You can enhance your home network by positioning your router in a central location, away from other electronic appliances. As for the modem, as long as it doesn't interfere with the router, feel free to tuck it away behind a houseplant. In sum, while both the router and modem are vital for internet access, they have distinct functions. The modem connects your home to the internet, while the router distributes this connection to your devices. Understanding these differences can help you better manage and improve your home network.